Jonathan. Guys who've been in here talked about the goals and playoffs and things like that. For you, how do, having been here longer than everybody, how does it feel to have that kind of goal for the first time in, in the NBA? Um, it's exciting. I mean, I think it's uh, one of the things I've I've wanted most over the last few years. Um, you know, this is going in year five, and um, I still haven't been able to experience playoff basketball. And um, just knowing that that's our goal and um, seeing the growth from year to year from the time that I've been here, I think I think we're ready to take that next step forward. Okay. Jason, right over here. It's your fifth year, but what are your thoughts on the new training facility? Oh, I think I spent more time there than I have at my house since it's been up. So um, just very appreciative of, um, you know, Mr. Fatita and um, the organization. I mean, this is one of the top best facilities I've ever um, been able to, you know, train in and um, you can't keep guys out of the gym. Just every, doesn't matter what time of day, um, there's somebody in there on the team getting work in and um, it just gives us a, a safe space. And um, I think as NBA athletes, we need that. And um, it's going to be very, um, what's the word I want to want to want to say? It's going to be very eye opening to see what we do this year. Jay Sean, um, the years that you've been here, there's always been a lot of changes, whether it's with the roster, with the coaching staff. How much easier is it to come into this season when basically the entire staff is the same and the entire roster is the same? Yeah, um, like you said, uh, the last few years has just been um, completely different. And to just be able to like kind of run it back with the same team with a, a, a few additional pieces, um, I think we're going to hit the hit the ground rolling, rolling tomorrow at training camp. And um, there's a lot of little... Um, things we don't really have to go over necessarily because um, we are we've been been around here this summer and um, you know we we've learned we had a year of, of learning each other with um, players and coaches so I'm excited to see how this camp goes. Brian, Jason, right here. <clears throat> um, you've always been one of those people who you know fought for everything that you got. You know you came when you got here you were fighting for for playing time. You made the roster. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of competition at the spots that, that you are at the three and the four position. How do you feel going into camp knowing that you're going to have to, you know, basically compete for those spots mm -hmm. again? Um, just excited. Um, I think every day we walk in here, we're competing. You know, that's part of it. And um, with that, it's just going to raise the level of everybody, uh, which will make us ultimately a, a better team. So um, I don't think anybody on this team is ducking any competition. Uh, we're kind of just looking forward to it. Jeff. When uh, Dylan was in here earlier, he said it, one of the things he learned about the team last year was the team had a little bit of fight in them. Mm -hmm. And that seems to be something going forward. Um, how are you feeling about that? Because you're, you know, really your signature is that you're everywhere on the floor and you play with a lot of toughness. Is that something you see from this team that's beginning to develop? a kind of a personality. Yeah, definitely. I think you saw it with uh, how our rookies didn't back down last year. Um, that's just kind of the culture that we are continuing to build. And um, just knowing that when I take the floor, there's other dogs out there with me um, is, is awesome. Cause you know, you got your, your teammates have their, have your back. So, um, you know, there's going to be some, some heated battles and we're looking for it. We're looking for a fight. Uh, from day one, you've been one of the best defensive players on the Rockets. Last year, the Rockets were a top 10 defensive team. Uh, how is it for you being a defensive-minded player, being able to play for a defensive-minded coach like M.A.? Um, it's great. Um, there's just so much that I've learned over this you know, past season with having a defensive-minded coach and um, the growth I've had. I've still got to you know, stop fouling as much. But um, other than that, man, just having that peace of mind on the offensive end, knowing that, you know, as long as you try hard on defense, um, that's the main thing. That's what our focus is. And, um, you know, I, I just enjoy being here. I, love, I enjoy playing for Coach, Coach Udoka. Jeff. 